Continuing our team coverage now on Winter Storm Anthony, it's time to take a live look in Tolland County. Check in on things there. Channel 3's Lauren Richardson has been in record tra weather tracker 2 this morning. Lauren, you're back in the car. Are you still in Tolland? Yeah, Nicole and Wendell, uh, so we are actually seeing an improvement on the roadways, that's for sure. Right now on I-84, this is actually in Stafford Springs, so we're pretty far north. And showing you the road conditions, you can see they've cleared off. The DOT has done a great job, really, of clearing this area in general. Earlier, uh, when we were out and about, we were seeing a lot of the side roads looking pretty messy out there. But I did give a call before to Vernon Police just to check in to see how their morning has been going. And they said it has been uneventful, a lot of people staying off the roadways and staying safe, which is important. All right, before I went on Facebook, I asked a bunch of you, what is it like in your neighborhood? Because I wanted to know genuinely what it looked like outside. I heard from Beth in Bristol. She said it's not bad. It's winter. Uh, Phil said actually the roads in Waterford are snow covered and to be careful out there and just a lot of different uh, opinions, just really depending on where you are. Uh, Michael actually said he got six inches of snowfall in Westbrook. So definitely, once again, just take it slow, take it safe out there. We're going to continue to keep you posted too on the highway conditions but luckily enough it looks like uh, a lot of the worst of the overnight snow the heavier bands of snow has passed at this point so we are still seeing some very light snowfall we'll be keeping you posted i'm lauren richardson channel 3 eyewitness news lauren thank you we are